here's the uh, individual components of the JCS 4200 uh, system here's the joystick uh, controller with the uh, switching also the uh, st a twist of the stick for the Z axis and then deflecting this way forward and aft for the uh, deflector or bucket movement up and down and then sideways of course does the um, bow thruster or feature if you have twin engines it will engage the uh, thrust the uh, deflectors in a way that will move the boat sideways and as you can see that every one of these uh, cables have connectors on them these amp connectors which are quick twist type and also on the enclosure uh, for the system they're the quick disconnect amp connectors too um, also in a uh, junction box we have at times in the aft section of the vessel uh, comes with connectorization on it for quick uh, install and has uh, flanges for easy mounting and also an industrial control box uh, in a sealed water tight. Uh, there's the CPU unit, one of them in the back here in this uh, background. And uh, this controls a twin jet with steering and also uh, uh, deflector features, sideways movement. Uh, here's some of the cabling uh, that controls or that connects the control box CPU uh, to the actuators. In this case, we're using the 274 Hamiltons, and so we're using uh, actuators to control the lever valve. Um, these are electronic high quality actuators, DC actuators, um, and these will connect to the junction box, which connects to the jumper cable to the CPU. And there's port and starboard here. And so, um, this is a, just the uh, system itself, the complete system for uh, this particular application. Normally, on uh, most vessels, if it's not a 274, we use, uh, we connect directly with a hydraulic valve pack, and if uh, need be, we would build our own hydraulic valve pack, but most often we interface with the valve pack that is um, provided, or valves that are provided with the jet. Um, if they are not, then we can, like I said, provide our own. So here's the complete system layout of uh, one of our systems, a JCS 4200.